Hello, I'm Richard Vobes, the bald explorer, out on another walk, and we're on a very busy road, which has suddenly got very quiet. Yes, briefly. Uh, I'm with the wonderful Dump Man. Hello, Dump Man. Hello there, nice to see you again. We're doing another disused railway exploration. We are. Where are we, Dump Man? We're in Argus Hill. It's a little village in East Sussex, uh, and we're going to look at a tunnel which was on the Cuckoo Line. A tunnel. Yes, like we like a that. tunnel. Don't we haven't we? done a tunnel for a while. Been a while. It's now, too long, actually. I gather we've got to do a bit of scrabbling. Quite a bit. Okay. Yeah. Shall we? Stinging nettles and everything. Oh, lovely. <laughs> I got bare legs. So have I. All right. Shall we get scrabbling? Let's do it. Let's do it. Cross the road. Right? So we've got to cross the road and dive through a bit of a hedge. I'll let you go first because you know where you're going. And. <laughs> And already, <laughs> he nearly disappeared. <laughs> yeah, just get past this old fence post. It looks like it's a well-travelled path, this dump man. Yeah. People have clearly... I've been here once or twice, you know. Yes. One would hope so. Thank you very much. Now, your chances of sliding here are very high. OK. I'll have a, a high-level slide. This reminds me of the uh, cinder one, what's it called? Cinder, Cinder Hill Tunnel. Cinder Hill Tunnel, that's right. Yeah, we had to sort of come down the cutting, really. You can see it from above here. It's quite... Uh, oh, here we go. Quite a nice view. Oh, yeah. This is Argus Hill Tunnel. Argus Hill Tunnel. It's quite an unusual tunnel because of the number of recesses in the wall. Ah. That might sound like an anorakish detail, but when you see it, you'll know what I mean. Yeah, I can see one from here, right at the entrance. So we'll try not to uh, s slip down. We'll do try and look uh, professional and uh, explorer-like. It's not too, not too much of a dip though, is it? No, Down this, uh, fortunately. So this is on the cuckoo, the old cuckoo line or close yeah. to the cuckoo line, but the this isn't a bit that you can cycle on, is it? Because you can. Absolutely not. No, I mean, if you, I don't know if you can get a, a view in that direction. Yeah, but, let's. Um, I mean, you can walk it if you struggle through, but it's not a footpath. No, not an um, official one. But it's not particularly fenced off either, so best oh, right. of luck. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Argus Hill Tunnel, on the other hand, is looking to the north. And, and already I can see it's quite a small tunnel. It short is, tunnel. It is quite a short tunnel. And I've been told, I don't know if this is the case, fairly sure it is the case, that it was built by a cut and cover. So you always think of a tunnel being tunneled through the rock. Uh, but actually, in this case, they just dug a huge trench, built a tunnel and then covered it up again. Oh, I see. Yeah. Oh, right for you trivia fans. Yes, I suppose it's not that much to dig out. The hill doesn't go no, vastly not, above no, it. Not that deep. Yeah. Not that deep. Shall we look? Let's 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 go into the tunnel. So this is uh, a tunnel wide enough clearly for two trains abreast. Uh, I think it's built as a yes, yeah, yeah. it's built, built as a double. I'm not sure if it, if it had I don't know if it had twin track in it. Right. It would have been built as a double probably. Oh, okay suggests the end of the route happily, end of route no access yeah. all quiet queries all please quiet call mayfield yeah. and something parish council well we're not quite i'm not quite at the end of that route no i can see the end of the route it's yeah. the other side of that I see what you mean about these recesses that's the thing that's what's that's why so unusual why are they here i have no idea okay. because no, I mean, there's no particular reason why you would have to have quite so many recesses for the safety of workers yes. in such a short tunnel. I think it's probably to do with the fact that it was a cut and cover construction. Ah. But, uh, so it may be more to do with strength, actually. Right, than, than, actual, than an escape route for people. But it is quite unique. There aren't any others in Sussex that look quite like this. There was another tunnel south of here, which was Mayfield Tunnel. It looked exactly the same. And that was the one used on the TV programme, The Prisoner, all those years ago when the guy, you know, runs out of the tunnel. In the opening credits. Yeah, it? that's it. So, yeah. We can see these recesses a lot yeah. better here. Yeah. As there's a little bit more light now hitting, uh, hitting them. Yeah, but a lot of fancy brickwork, though, yeah. on the top. So this one was built, uh, or opened, in 1880. Uh, and it was also one of the first to close in this area being closed in, I think, 1965, oh, which yeah. is a beaching closure. So not really very many years of use, considering all the work. So, uh, yeah, and that seems to be 
a repeated story yeah, on these doesn't railways, it just, doesn't it? Yeah, feature. A lot of a lot of industrial hard work, only for a very short life. Yeah. So over this way is the view to the north, uh, Redgate Mill. What else have we got that way? Going up towards um, London. Yeah, well, ultimately London. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And the North Downs, presumably. Yeah. But yeah. uh, none of it, none of it in this direction is, is footpath. It's all no. Well, it looks very it's impenetrable now. Grown, yeah. There's another bit of a sign here. Let's see what I kick that over. No, nothing. Nothing. <laughs> nothing on that one. Yeah. But nice, nice tunnel entrance. It's a fabulous structure, isn't it? Yeah. You and just wonder how long it will last. I mean, how long will it sit here as some sort of secret reminder of the railways? You know, presumably like another hundred years, two hundred years. I mean, they must fall down eventually. Yeah. I mean, once the road starts to become dangerous. Yeah. Um, I'm guessing that that's when people engineers come and and have to either condemn it or fill it, fill in, it in or do whatever they fill do. It full of household waste or something. Like that. Yeah. <laughs> that would be a shame, wouldn't it? Yeah. It's oh, great. Shame. Haven't had a party in this one. But have you not? No, because no, you did have a party at Cinder, Cinder, Cinder Hill. Hill. Yeah. Yeah. But there's time. You, know. you never know. We might have a party yet. <laughs> Perhaps you'd all like to come. There we are. Yes. Well, <laughs> hopefully I'll be invited. Yeah, of course you will. Let's uh, let's have another walk through, shall we? Why not? Yeah. I can't Actually, resist it. It looks better from this end anyway. I think. I'm guessing this is a good time to go tunnel exploring, particularly after the weather we've had it, oh, because so many is. tunnels. You've still got huge puddles under here. Yeah. It hasn't rained for weeks. And there is a temperature drop, isn't there, as you come into here. Yeah. It does drop down by about three or four degrees. Oh, yeah. Certainly noticeable. Lovely and cool. Yeah. That would be a superb place for a party. Wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah, you could put little lights in those recesses. Absolutely. Little wick. But, you know, lights in bottles or night whatever. Lights. What lights? Those little night lights. Yes. Yeah. No bats or anything that, that's... I don't think it's long enough for bats. Right, you know, it's not dark it. enough. Well, you remember we did Cocking Tunnel that time. That was a, a bat sanctuary, but they're much, much longer, those ones. Yes, and I guess if there were bats, it would have been closed off. And actually notice here in the... If I come over here, there's obviously some pipe work to... to Allow drainage from from the hill. I'm assuming that's well, what these are. on the road, actually. Oh right. Yeah, because the road is directly above us, which is the A two six seven. If you want to come exploring. Yeah, I didn't Very say that. <laughs> not that I'm encouraging trespass or anything. No, no. Well, we're not doing any damage. We're no, just looking right. from a purely historical yes. uh, and heritage point just of view. Just looking. We're not even touching. No. So let's uh, let's get fur further enough back to give a nice end view of our tunnel here, and uh, wait for a ghost train to come chugging through. <laughs> yeah. And there it is. Look at that. It's fantastic. Isn't it? And that's the that's the funny thing. You're in your car. You're on the road. You just never know you've gone over a tunnel these yeah. days, which is such a shame. It is. I think they should be celebrated more, but. Uh... You know, for those of you who are keen enough, you can always come and find them. For the select few. The select few, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well done, man. It's been another exciting exploration, a tunnel, another bonus for us. We love a tunnel. We do love a tunnel. Yes. Uh, don't forget to check out Dumpman's films. He's got lots of films where you've been through quite a few tunnels. Yeah, all of them. Uh, so there you go. Check them out. In the meantime, join me again on another walk somewhere else. And see you then. Till then. Bye-bye.